first one, hopefully many. We're gonna get back in here. We're gonna see if we can't get us again. We're gonna see if we can't get us one more. What's the fish life? Ain't no, ain't, ain't no life like the fish life, baby. Sitting over a uh, little pool, clear pool full of trout. About a handful of 24 inches in there. And I'm shaking like a dog shitting razor blades. Got one. Oh my god, guys. Thanks for catching your fish. Get the net. Okay. What's going on, guys? Welcome to today's episode. Uh, I'm joined by Mr. Annie Oakley himself, Tyler Collins. Thanks, Rush. <laughs> it's glad to be here. Nice for having you. Uh, today we take a little trip up to the Yellowtail uh, Dam at Bighorn Lake, I believe is what it's called. Officially. The official name of that lake. Yes, sir. And uh, we bust out the fly rod, and we decide to do a little early morning trout fishing. Get a few on top, get a few on streamers, get a few on nymphs. So we got the first fish of the day here, guys. It's a little skinny, but it's still a solid 23-inch fish. To start off the day, there isn't nothing better on a four-weight. And it was, a, it was a pretty surprising strike. I mean, it, it, it happened... Quite rapidly, actually. I mean, we, we showed up, <clears throat> threw, the, threw the pole out, and got a bite. Yeah, thanks for catching that fish, Tyler. I wanted to catch it. Here we go, guys. The lady's a little mad. I'm, I'm poaching her fish, but we're going to get her back in there and get her in on one. So. And as you can tell, the, uh, here, the bite is on. Some good fish throughout the episode. And the reason they look so beat up like that, the, the reason the coloring is so off-colored is because they just got out of the spawn. And a lot of these aren't spawners. They're false spawners that were put in the lake. Which means that they don't know how to spawn. They have all the stuff to spawn, but they don't know how to run up, make beds, and those sort of things. So those eggs kind of fall out naturally. And they ever, never ever, ever wind up spawning. But yeah, that's kind of the reason they're so uh, beat up and, and discolored is because it's spending a lot of energy. And it, they're just coming into their summer summer habitat, so they're going to change colors once they get to the lake. This is a good one. But right here, uh, Sub Sabrina gets her chance at the uh, the good old four weight and uh, hooks onto a real nice trout. Jump in the water to fish this net I'm going to. Oh, Sab's got a big one on, huh? Oh my goodness. And the reason we're kind of so concerned here is because right underneath this uh, this pile of rocks here, there is a massive log jam. Fight them out. Fight them out. And there's, there's a, as you can tell, sharp rocks right underneath us along with a bunch of, a bunch of wood and stuff. So that's why we have the extendo handle there to reach about, honestly, 10 feet I, is, is what 10 it feels to 15, like. yeah. yeah. It, it was a long reach. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, she always catches the bigger fish. Always. Ooh, she's happy. That's a happy girl right there. Get it in the boat. How can you not be happy when the fish life yeah. is your life? And a sigh of relief like there is Tyler. The boat. Like the fish life. Saves himself and his relationship along with uh, that fish's girlfriend just caught. So pretty. Get in there, Sabs. That's a nice fish. That's but yeah, fish. the the coloring on that fish is Ain't definitely no like the fish uh, not like a, wow. like a regular trout. So today we're up on Yellowtail and water's muddy. I mean, go ahead and look around real quick. Water is muddy. We got these strings of, of nastiness through there. And so what we do is we come up back into one of these tributaries where the water's real clean, the water's real nice, and we come up over here and it just so happens that we luck out and get a bunch of these 
Oh, see. Get a bunch of these big fish. Then I finally get my chance on the uh, sticks here. What? And when do we catch this one on? A streamer? I'm not sure. Let's find out. This one might be a bunny. A little white bunny. It was white. Yeah, that's all I know. No. Yeah. It was, one, it was one of those lighter, natural, minnow type. Nope, leaders. that's a little black leech. That's a little bead headed leech there. Then, as I said before, there's a bunch of trout just stacked up right, right over that that rock there. So, we're just trying to drop something in right in front of them. There we go. As if he wants to play, we find one. That's like number four, I think. Yeah. Yeah. You've got one. Sav's got one. I got one. Yeah. You've got another one. No, but they, I figured out how to get that chromie to eat it finally. That's a nice. That's a nice trout. Oh wow. That is a nice trout, dude. There was a bunch of nice trout in that that little spot. It's kind of funny, right as we rolled up, four or five different boats came up looking to fish that same spot. There it is. Oh. Nice fish. These poor fish have been caught so many times in here. Yeah. This, uh, this is a healthy looking fish here. Wow. You can tell he's a little more red though. Definitely some cutthroat in that fish. Wow. I think this is the last fish of the day. Last trout. This. You're just jigging that uh, that streamer along, bouncing it like a dead little fish. Well, like, not like a dead creature. little fish. You're just what you're wanting to do is you want to get the most movement out of your streamer. Inch per inch, so in no, six inches, you don't want to strip six couple. inches, you want to strip an inch a piece. No, that's a little smallmouth right there. That's just the uh, the top side view of this pool that's there, incredible. crystal clear with just a bunch yeah, of fish is. stacked. Too far, you put it on top of it. Yeah, we jump over to fly fishing here for carp or drag it, drag it, drag carp it, ABM. Hit him. Talk about time. I Coming close on it. That was after a long, hard struggle of, of miss, 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 miss. Lots of misses. Oh man, yeah, I was on one. The struggle is real. Fish are there, and then they're not. And all we're doing here is just using the trolling motor and uh, kind of searching for, for active rising carp right on the surface. Now the fun part. And of course you got to fight them out. You got to run them. Still they, running the four weight. They, Mr. Bull. This is Sab's getting a close up strike. Right, right in shotgun right there. This is Tyler just being greedy. This is all 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 this is. Oh, there's one. He's a, he's mine. Okay. That was like the perfectly wrong angle. <laughs> perfectly wrong angle. Only Tyler Collins right there. <laughs> yeah, that one. This one too. 
This is like the, the least aggressive carp I've ever seen. Hits it, and he just knows it's game over. Okay, I've given up. What do we do? We fish for life? It ain't nothing but the fish life. Ain't nothing better than the fish life. Just a little floating right there, you know. Gotta keep that dry fly dry. Some liquid dry shake. Guy's choice. Put him on. Put him on. This fish came up and like was excited about the fly, but turns out he didn't want it. Oh, fucking, he had it. Then. Or just a late set. Or just, I don't know what that was. We can be modest. Like, I suppose he didn't want it, but the I fish would was say excited. he like chased it. Fish or you? <laughs> this fish actually came right after a uh, a tip on my <laughs> Rush Boards Outdoors Pro Tyler Collins, uh, <laughs> and I just decided to whip around him. I don't know, it's like 20 yards right there, I think, somewhere in there. 20 feet, maybe. And after six de devastatingly horrible casts, I, what? I, I land the Hit one. Oh, bro. She's game on. See? Let's line go. Just let it go. You got to do it yourself if I can yeah, learn, no right? Oh. Nice was that a good one? That was. Was that a good one? Yeah. You like it felt good. It felt like good. That? I like it. felt good. Yeah, it did. Ooh. It looked like shit. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. All right, guys. Well, thanks so much for yeah, watching this episode. It's been a pleasure uh, making another one for you. And uh, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, see you later. See you later, guys. Ain't nothing better than the fish life. I don't know who looks better naked, Rush or Sabrina. <laughs> gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous.